Hi, Geminis. Thank you so much for tuning in. Just a quick reminder, it's not a personal reading. It's a general reading. It could be also a prediction. So this is a general. We're going to move on to new love after. And if you want to skip over to the you versus me reading, you can. Let's get started. Geminis. What do we have for Gemini spirit lines? Turned. Ooh, Gemini. Well, we... My younger years, maybe 10, 15 years. Ooh, okay. Okay, so... Hmm... There is some wild acting, like acting wild, a state of being wild. Maybe there's um, drugs, alcohol, crazy party, drunk, um, excited. Hmm. And you're putting it on Instagram. <laughs> Many look up to you, public. Maybe you're in the spotlight, famous, popular, Instagram fame. Maybe you're getting turned up and putting it on Instagram. I don't know if you guys are still using that word. Oh my god, I feel old. Okay, let's see. I feel I I think you guys are still using that word. Right let's see. Why do we have this here for Gemini's? I feel like you're actually looking down your memories, your pictures, your friends. Um wishing. I don't know why I'm getting that for some of you. Insta famous. Also, we have maybe uh, you're on the spotlight or you're wanting to be insta famous. Let's see. Give me more on this hunt. Oh, I shuffled. That's a, um, a Libra's? No, Aquarius first card. Okay, so I'm getting that you overspent on crazy things, maybe a crazy party or you're wanting to overspend. Ooh, birthday is coming up in May, so be careful if you're overspending, if you're giving away your money. <laughs> um, you can shoot some over, but <laughs> I'm just kidding. There's, um, maybe you're just paying too many bills I'm getting also you're paying too many, um, making your payments, your, yeah, like there's money leaving you for some of you, but this is also indicating maybe there is a lack mentality of money, like maybe you are, more is leaving your pocket than coming in, you know what I mean? So I kind of see, it kind of seems like you wish that maybe you were back in your olden days, your your old days when you didn't have to worry about this stuff. Or maybe you did spend a lot um, in the past, in some past event. Give me more of this Insta Famous. Okay, so I'm getting, there could have been some Instagram drama here maybe you are looking at memories how you used to be in the spotlight how you used to be popular around friends you used to go out with friends and spend a lot of money um but it was kind of a little toxic as well you went through a toxic phase which a lot of us do let's see Wow. So now you're more serious about, so I feel like now you're more serious about taking care of yourself. You've grown, you've matured, your emotions haven't matured. Maybe before you were here and now you're kind of looking back and saying, wow, I was very unstable before I feel. Um, and now you're maturing. There could be also new love. Somebody that is insta famous coming towards you. That's what I see. Okay. So let's see, what do we have? Give me more 
on Gemini. It could be also an old friend, but I feel like it's some kind of new love with the Ace of Cups here. For most of you, though, you're just taking care of yourself. You're just thinking back of how it used to be before. Maybe you're just going back to those days where you weren't really responsible. Give me more for Gemini's and this message. Series. Keep hush. Careful who you trust at this time. Not everyone needs to know your business. Make silent moves towards success. So if you are trying to get out of this mindset or trying to get out of this um, toxic group or anything toxic, you're trying to move forward because you've matured here. Um, keep your dreams, your goals, your desires, your whatever you're going towards, keep them out of Instagram because you are you are kind of popular and people probably look up to you and they really admire you. Come on, you're a Gemini. You um you're a social butterfly, you know? So keep those things because you might have a lot of people with kind of envious of your life, okay? So just be careful with that. Yeah, it could really bring some evil, you know, evil eye. You could um, attract the evil eye or some drama because some people don't like the way that you're living your life. Maybe you're living your life from a fast lane or maybe you're maturing and now it's time to settle down your feeling. I don't know who I'm getting that for. You're maturing. But people will still look up to you. Home needs, TLC. Give your home some attention. Re redecorate, clean it, or sage it. I feel like you need to really clear your space, your friends, your energy, sage, everything. Okay? So that is what I'm getting. Let's get into new love for Gemini, Spirit Guides. Let's get into new love for Gemini. What do we have for new love? Hopefully it's new love. And not old love. Okay, persistent wanted to come out. Faded. Oops. One more. Four Geminis. Work. Mm, okay. Persistent. I'm going to keep trying until you, you say yes. Faded. It was destined to happen. Work. You're so smart. I love that I can discuss work with you. So somebody here is going to be very persistent wanting you to say yes, to go out. Um, they're going to think you're smart, you're intelligent because you, you know, you're a communicator. You are social butterfly. Like I said, I'm going to like talking to you even about work. You could even, you know, have, be in, have something in common. Let's see. Give me more of this persistent. Why would they have to persist here? Maybe you're trying to play hard to get. Oh, because you're trying to leave something from the past, something toxic. Yeah, you're trying to leave something in the past. That could also resonate with the top reading. Um, you're trying to leave toxic ways. You're trying to leave toxic or just emotional baggage and you don't want to get into something else so soon give me more of this faded but something here is faded for you to start all over give me more of this work hopefully it's not at work for some of you because you don't want to complicate things okay so this person is going to be pretty serious about you gemini could be a fire sign a leo a capricorn water yeah, I feel like they'll have a hard time flirting with you, but they're going to be very persistent because they do want something serious long term. Could be uh they find you very attractive. They want to start start with you, start all over with the devil and the ace of wands though. Be careful because this person might want one thing at first, but we have the 10 of pentacles, which it could have potential to work things out towards like a very solid 
commitment long term they find you very attractive that's why that's why they're gonna just persist if you don't want it, I feel like this person will even become a little obsessed with you until you say yes, okay? Because they do want something real with you. They really are very attracted to you, Gemini. So, it could be a Pisces. It could be water in general. We have Earth. We have Leo, um, Fire, Capricorn, Water, Scorpio. Could be a Earth sign, Air sign. Okay, so that is what I have. I hope this helped. And if you're still interested in an old connection, the you versus me reading is next. If not, then thank you so much for watching and take care of you. Bye. Hi, Geminis. Thank you so much for tuning in. Quick reminder, um, it's not a personal reading. It's a general reading. And tarot police, uh, there's a certain way I read cards, of course. Other of cards influence others. Please um, understand. Also, well, Geminis are pretty cool. I don't... Let's just get started. Geminis, Geminis. I know I'm being biased. <laughs> um... Give me more on Gemini. Give me Gemini's and this connection. What's their energy? Ooh, I saw that in my pre-shuffle. Gemini's, I know. Um, especially if you're a Gemini Ascended. Ooh. You might feel like you've lost your friends, you've lost um, your connections, you've lost... Uh, why? Because Saturn just left our 8th house, if you're following Western. Um, or, yeah. And you've gone through some endings here. So that could be for someone here. I don't, I don't know. It just depends on your chart, of course. Rejection. I'm not an astrologer, by the way, okay? And I don't pretend to be one. So let's see. So your issue here is a rejection. Let's see, what is this person? How is this person seeing you? Ooh, Gemini. <laughs> this person is seeing you as a, a, a little bit controlling. Interesting. Or... They were trying to control you. And you know Geminis can't be controlled. Mm -mm. But I'm sensing that maybe they're seeing you as a little bit controlling because we have rejection here. And they kind of... They put you in a... in. A, well, it could be them too, I'm getting. Mm -hmm. Because it kind of made you... They kind of wanted to, to control the situation. But... Things didn't really pan out the way they wanted to because they kind of made you feel a rejection, like a sense of rejection here, and you're having a hard time moving past this. Um, you know, honestly, when I pulled this one and I put it down, I was getting more of they hurt your ego. You know, like, wow, I can't believe they did that to me. You know, that kind of feeling. I don't know. That's probably for one person. So caught at the bottom of the deck. Ooh, Gemini. Did you get caught doing something? Mm. I don't know. That's what I'm getting. Or maybe you caught them doing something. But I feel like it's more of a... No, we'll see some more. Let's see. What's their energy towards Gemini? Spirit lines, what's their energy towards Gemini? Okay. Yeah. They were kind of avoiding you and they made you feel rejected. Um... I'm sensing someone here kind of made you mad and you really wanted to talk to this person or do something. Want You wanted them to do something and you kind of got into that energy where you wanted to control the situation because this is the way they're seeing you. Um, this person though, 
they're not in their power okay this is in your power but this is this is positioned in their problem here their issue their uh, what their challenge and then we have the divine masculine which i feel like this person has been i feel like this person is daydreaming for some reason we have fireworks now i don't sense that this is happiness because it's at the bottom of the deck there is no happiness there's no um celebration no um yeah maybe something here went up in smoke fireworks um maybe again i'm sensing somebody here got in an argument because the other person they were trying to avoid you and it kind of made you even more mad because they were being either rude or trying to avoid you okay let's get into it give me more on this loneliness for gemini spirit I dropped something. Loneliness. Ugh. The Knight of Swords wants to come out, so there probably was some drama there. Wow. So I feel like you're wanting to talk to this person, Gemini. Um, there is a Gemini here, okay, that is wanting you probably there's someone probably that doesn't want to, they're just here, but if you don't want to talk to this person, I don't know why you're in a you versus me reading. But we have page, two pages for me is a conversation. And I feel like you are feeling lonely, really do want, oh, you kind of think about maybe having a conversation with this person. Some of you feel that this person is going to come towards you to apologize, to want to spend time with you. Okay. I feel like you feel that way. For others of you, of course, you want you're willing to have an open conversation with them or you just wanted to talk to them, but I feel like this person is just avoiding you or the situation between you two. Give me more of this rejection for Gemini's. Wow, they really did hurt you. They probably were also breadcrumbing you. And they just hurt you. They betrayed you because they weren't giving you the attention or they weren't meeting you halfway. You felt like you were giving more most of the your energy and they weren't. So you feel you felt a bit a bit betrayed because it was more of like, Well, I'm always there when I need you, but when I need to talk to you, you're not there. Mm-hmm. That's what it kind of feels like. It could be something similar to that. I'm not saying that that is it. Give me more of this um, control. Okay, too many. Give me one more for this control. Okay, so... We have, whoa, double Leo here. <laughs> Interesting, we have double Leo. Okay, so what I'm getting here is that maybe you were kind of hurt. Your ego was kind of hurt. And you were trying to resist. You were trying to maybe kind of be in control or just trying to control the situation here. Trying to talk things out, but in a calm way. Um... Yeah, like wanting to overcome this obstacle that you both faced. But now they're seeing you that you are... It's interesting because you see... They're probably seeing you hold back and just overcoming this situation. Because he's holding her neck and you see the, the girl here with the lion. She's holding the lion's mouth of course trying to close a mouth but look at it. it's almost the same position so it's like maybe they were trying to control you to you know not say a lot or trying to tame you but there was some it could have been some ego here as well like i said 
Hmm. Give me more of this avoidance. Okay. I don't know why I'm feeling like this person is seeing you as actually getting over this already. Mm hmm. Give me more of this avoidance. Holding back, but getting over it at the same time. Like. So you're seeing this person as being very confused, not knowing what they want. Maybe they wanted their options open or you, they were waiting for another option. Oh, I just got that for someone. This person actually was thinking that maybe they were going to find someone better. Okay. For some of you. That's why they were trying to avoid maybe something serious with you. Hmm. Or this person was trying to make you wait because they were, you know, going towards their own dreams or maybe just other options. Give me more of this in your power. I feel like within your power here, they are a very low confident person. Yeah, I feel like this person is not happy. Yeah. Okay, this person is not happy ever since maybe you stopped giving to this situation. Ever since both of you stopped giving to this connection, they are not happy. They're not in their power. Like I said, this is at the root of their problem, which is not feeling confident. And they're not happy here. You're not happy either. But I feel like this is you. You stopped giving to the situation, so they don't, they're not happy with it. Give me more of this Divine Masculine. Let's see. It could be them. They're wanting to maybe travel just to get their mind off of this. Could be their mind off of you. Or they're actually even probably strategizing or planning on coming towards you. Taking a leap of faith forward towards you. I'm seeing someone here traveling. Maybe somebody from San Francisco as well I'm getting um because it's being highlighted to me but um getting yeah this person actually wants to come towards you now and you you don't know this but they want to come towards you they're stressing about it though see six of cups at the bottom of the deck they're reminiscing about you let's see what is what is this person thinking about gemini intimate date I told you they want to come towards you divinely guided oh I think Aquarius just got that I think skepticism a fire sign got that too soulmate mm. okay so the challenge could be starting new here new beginning intimate date Let's go out, have a drink or two, and have a little fun. Divinely guided. This relationship is being divinely guided and protected. Skip skepticism. Give me time to trust this connection. Soulmate. You are my soulmate. A dream come true. Wow. So, they're skeptic about this um, connection, though. I feel like they just don't feel confident that they can even give you something real, a true commitment. That's what I'm also getting with the uh, Four of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles. They don't feel like they can give you something serious, but they do feel this connection with you. They feel stressed about it, but they're very skeptic and they're, they're being divinely guided. Okay. So they're, I'm getting soulmate twin flame connection here so they do want to go out and do something i feel like out of somewhere maybe they're they're planning to spontaneously just um call you or text you or something here okay there could be a conversation coming up 
Okay, so. Give me more on this person towards Gemini. I feel butterflies when I'm around you. You're very intimidating. I really miss you. I see you in everything. You're always with me. See? And this... And I thought so because, of course, we have the Nine of Swords here. But this person looks like he's sleeping. Of course, it's not gender specific, but it's the message that it brings. Like they're sleeping. Maybe at sleep they have a hard time sleeping or they think about you. They dream about you a lot. Yeah. So that's what I'm getting. Someone here is dreaming about you or you're dreaming about them. Okay. Let's see. Give me advice for the person watching this video. This reading, Spirit Guides, advice for the person watching this reading. Don't be jealous or compete with anyone. It's not helpful and can grow old and exhausting over time. Jealousy is is an internal battle so take steps to get to know and work on yourself maybe you're also maybe you're trying to control something because you have um insecurities as well you know you're not trusting trust me gemini's when somebody messes up it's very hard to gain that trust back the person needs to be willing to earn that trust back i know okay i've been through it in the past so that's probably what kind of drove you both apart here so that could be for someone okay so really um taking steps to get to know and work on you but it can be very exhausting do you really want to be like that as well you know a year from now two years three years you know sooner or later you're just gonna get tired of it or they will okay so we have fire we have taurus we have aries pisces um could be another gemini fire signs water mm, leo could be earth signs air signs earth let's see pisces okay so that is what i have i also have earth here Mm. Yep. Yeah. So thank you so much for watching and take care of you. Mm, bye.